our coverage of one of the greatest tennis events in the world. Here in Eastbourne, Rosano has lost the opening set. It's Wozniacki 7-6. It's good effort from Ro Wozniacki to pull through that set because it's so easy when you blow a big lead. She was up 5-2 to really let your concentration slip and give the set away. She recovered nicely. Drop shot's been a useful tool for Rosano. She's really pushing Wozniacki behind the baseline because she does hit the ball so flat and hard. So that opens up the drop shot. Well, tennis players are very superstitious, and Rosano, her superstition is to never look at the draw of a tournament. Did you have any superstitions like that, or did you? No. No? But I know a lot of players that don't step on the lines, that have to have new shirts for every match, that have to wash the same shirt for every match. <laughs> it varies. Some of the men don't shave over the course of a tournament. They're a quirky bunch, those tennis players. Well, here's uh, a break point for Wozniak in the opening game. When you were going through to the Wimbledon doubles championship with Lindsay Davenport, any superstitions along no, the way? No, just please don't mess this up. <laughs> <laughs> that was the predominant thought. Yeah. Well, thank God Lindsay had a strong partner. <laughs> Yeah, it was all about me. Had nothing to do with the fact she didn't lose a set in the singles or the doubles that year. Wow, that was unusual. And that count that's that counts as the a fault. Serve. Yeah, she stopped tried to stop, I should say, midway through the serve. Second serve. On a break point. I'm not gonna attempt to explain that. wearing down Rosano in that exchange. For a moment, I thought these two were doing the down-the-line cross-court drill. Wozniacki going down the line and Rosano countering that with the cross-court, but we talked about how effective the down-the-line is on grass. Wozniacki's used that well today. Tamarine Tanasugarn winning tournament in the Netherlands. She upset Dinara Safina in the semifinals yesterday. That's a great result for her. Some um, numbers from the opening set. Rosano, high percentage of first serves, but she was broken the one occasion. It's not enough winning tennis at the right times. Trying Nearly. to make sense of those stats. Yeah. <laughs> because Rosano has five more winners and unforced errors, a higher first service percentage, yet still lost the set. Love. Wozniacki playing solid tennis throughout the course of this match. It's 
really the one hiccup that she had when she served for the first set at 5-3. Convert the volley. Forty love. Doing a nice job underlining this break now at forty love. Well, she'd served 21 aces coming into this match. And she is adding to that total here in the final. So two love now. Can she hold on to the break, which she failed to do in the opening set? She's serving well today. That's something that hurt her yesterday. She didn't serve as well as she had been. The conditions were so much tougher. It was so windy yesterday. Love. Thirty love. If anything else, Rosano has proved very resilient this week. She's uh, faced plenty of adversity and has handled it surprisingly well. So she's going to stay within reach if she can close out this service game down just the one break. Take the game. Wozniacki has a set and a break.